So today we're um, lucky enough to have lunch at a restaurant called Demoiselle. Um, Demoiselle is actually located in City Walk. Um, we're having lunch downstairs, but I've come upstairs to interview the general manager, who's um, a gentleman here called Carrado, who's actually Italian, the restaurant's French. He's going to tell us about um, what Demoiselle uh, actually means. Certainly. Uh, hi, Monica. Basically, the demoiselle is an old word of um, uh, mademoiselle, so a young lady. So the, the very polite and old word is demoiselle. So that's, this is what demoiselle means. Okay, thank you. And tell us a little bit about the decor of the restaurant, perhaps Certainly. starting with the ceiling. Certainly. Our ceiling basically is all uh, birds that are uh, coming from one of the famous books which Chris Galvin likes, which is uh, Bird of America. So the funny story behind it is also that the, the book is being first initiated in London and then finishing in Edinburgh, in uh, Scotland, so where we also have uh, restaurants. We have a restaurant in London and a restaurant in Edinburgh. So that's why uh, Chris Galvin decided to have in his decor. The birds. And um, as we came up, we saw some very beautiful cutlery. Um, let's go and talk about it. This is uh, coming from um, Chris Garvin, where uh, he likes old fashioned uh, decor of um, teaspoons. So he decided to have a selection of uh, antique and uh, silver uh, teaspoons with different style, with different. Uh, uh, decor on, on, on each teaspoon, so they also remind the uh, traditional afternoon tea that we usually serve in London in our roads. Okay, and over here we have a beautiful cabinet that's displaying teapots, the silver teapots? The, some of them are uh, brass antique, some of them are silver, so uh, there is again a good mixture of, of this uh, teapot, which they also coming from different, different culture. Okay, how many teapots are there? It's a huge... Yeah, it's about uh, uh, eight, 80 to 100 teapots. 80 to 100 teapots, wow. Okay. Are we going to have tea served at one of those teapots or are they just for display? These are uh, mainly for display, display. but we're also having a, a, a various uh, selection of teas that are getting served uh, in different teapots from uh, China, Japan or uh, India. So we're still at Demoiselle. Yeah. Um, this is Carrado who is pouring me. What's the name of this type of this coffee? This is a, a Boo 60. So basically, uh, what does we we making uh, a brewing of the coffee, mm -hmm. which is uh, gently coming and dripping into a container. Oh, lovely! Wow. Okay. And then we have here the uh, French brew, which is a kind of a pressing of the of the coffee, and then. Uh, again, it's another uh, method of uh, brewing the coffee as well. Wow. I've not seen anything like this in Dubai actually before. Maybe you have to go to this special coffee roast place. And look at that teapot for the water. And that's made of, is it copper? This is a copper, yes. Copper teapot with a beautiful spout there. It's lovely. 